The hardest bit about being homeless is, say you're sitting on a crate on the side of the street, you'll see about 100,000 people walk by you and not even notice that you exist, and I reckon that's the hardest bit. The main purpose of Front Yard is to provide a range of integrated services to young people between the ages of 12 and 25 who are experiencing homelessness from across Victoria. Melbourne Sea Mission's Front Yard Youth Service has been the leader in the provision of homeless services for young people since the late 80s. We've been working with thousands of young people each year who come through our door who are experiencing homelessness for a range of reasons, be that family violence, family breakdown, or experiencing significant trauma. I couldn't find housing because I was in a domestic violence type situation in my house and I was trying to find other accommodation but it wasn't working. So I eventually found myself on the streets because I didn't know where else to go at the point in time. My housing struggles didn't really start until I got exited from the system at the age of 18 and I was homeless on and off from then. When I first came to Front Yard, the staff greeted me friendly. They tried to get a gauge of what my living situation was like, my relationship with my peers and my parents. One of the main focuses of Front Yard is to disrupt homelessness for young people and to reduce them from entering into long-term homelessness as adults. Front Yard addresses the issues of youth homelessness by having a fully integrated service model which incorporates social workers, youth workers, lawyers, nurses, allied health therapists, music therapy, play therapy, a whole range of services that are there to work alongside a young person to help them deal with whatever they're presenting with. Even though we might be working with people who have had some pretty awful things happen in their lives, I think particularly in this age group, there is always that chance that you've got a greater chance of being able to make some changes in their lives that may allow them not to remain firmly entrenched in homelessness for a long time. Some of the common mental health issues that we see are young people coming with um, multiple diagnoses that they've picked up along the way, which is really confusing for their understanding of themselves and what's happening for them, but then also for future treatment planning. And um, Or they're coming to the service with really complex needs and presentations, but have never ever been assessed or diagnosed. Front Yard's been around for 30 years now and has learnt over the years as to what is needed for young people who are experiencing homelessness or rough sleeping. And so now we're adding 18 beds of crisis accommodation to our facility in King Street, as well as a whole range of other services to go alongside that. So things like street outreach, we're developing a digital engagement tool for young people, we're providing mental health and drug and alcohol services on site, and we're going to have 24-7 staffing models that ensure young people are kept safe and have the services they need when they need them. The whole community has got behind the redevelopment of Front Yard Youth Services from design right through to actually building and fit out of the, of the building. We've consulted with young people, the community, the sector, as well as working in partnership with state and federal government in terms of what's needed for young people. I think that the new Front Yard opening will be a lot better. It's got more accessible to people living with disabilities. It's updated, it's modern, it's what young people are after. Things have been going better for me. I've lived in increasingly more stable housing. I've managed to hold down work. And in general, I've just been, my life has just improved exponentially. I've wanted to be a youth worker since I was 16 and I'm currently starting a cert for in youth work at RMIT in the city. I came across Front Yard a few years ago when I was in my 20s. Um, they've helped me out in immaculate ways. They've actually got me into some form of employment with um, my youth ambassador stuff. When I was homeless, they helped me out getting an accommodation. They helped me out with my legal aid and everything. They are so good. I'm very excited about the future. I'm very excited about what we're doing. And I'm very excited about the services that we get to provide to young people.